Incredible modern giant beef processing technology and amazing meat cutting skills. Danish Crown DK. From peeling skins to dispatching into the market, each process is carried in these factories. The operations begin with peeling the skin of the animals and then cutting the animals into two co-equal parts. Eventually, each portion is separated, be it their heads or any other organ. Similarly, the factory supplies boneless beef too, which is packed well once they go after various processes. Additionally, minced meat is also produced with the help of machines which initially grind the boneless meat and then equally place them in boxes and further send it for upholstery. The minced meat is supplied in various shapes, like rounded and balanced. Additionally, as you can see in each factory, there is a great manner for carrying each bit of the operations hygienically, and cleanliness is maintained in each section, which assists the organization to build a great name in the provision of quality meat. These are various factories shown in the video which share the same purpose and mission that is to supply quality beef to the industry so that their customers can enjoy the best and most delicious beef. Before utilizing the meat for operations, it's ensured that the meats abide by the quality standards. Danish Crown has various factories that operate with a similar mission which is for the provision of quality meat for various distribution channels from whom the customers can purchase their quality meat and enjoy. Moreover, this company dispenses various categories of beef meat to meet the demands of each of its consumers across various regions, and the factories are well equipped with the latest type of machinery to carry most of the operations. But yes, these operations require a few manual procedures also. Ranch TV at Texas A&M AgriLife Extension. Cows and buffaloes are brought into the factory in a large number. Just after the slaughtering, the process for skin peeling is done at the first go. The peeling process is mostly carried with types of machinery, but it does contain some manual procedures too. The skin is rolled and sent to the concerned portion. Then the body is penetrated to take out the internal organs and escalate the body for further processes. Then the body is given an equal cut from the center while the process is carried with a giant cutter and with a conventional lifter that takes the employee to the desired location and carries his movements in several directions. Similarly, as you can see, one employee is specified for the removal of the spinal cord from the animals. Once this process is carried out, the meat also has to go through a final inspection which would be of the quality for detecting bacteria and similarities from the animals.
Those who pass the test are stamped and sent towards the next process. These operations are carried by the quality inspector, which is specified for the quality check only. Then the same meat is sent towards a portion where they're sparkled with water to soften the meat for having a smoother cut. Ultimately, the shattered but yet attached portions to the body are cut and separated and placed on the escalator where another manual team comes into action for the elimination of the fats that are visible on the meat. Similarly, every portion of the meat is set to a different portion, where several and different operations are carried to finalize various parts of the meat, such as making it boneless or packing the undercut of the cows in separate boxes. Once the meat is put in the plastic, the escalator takes them through a steamer. Finally, the meat is put in the boxes where it becomes ready to be floated to the market and different distribution channels. Conclusively, with the help of these greatest technologies and machines, the organization performs a time-consuming process in a more efficient manner and in due time. If you'd like to watch more similar videos, please click the like button and subscribe to our channel by pressing the bell icon so that you can be the first person to get the latest updates from us. And write down in the comment section what you'd like to watch in the next upcoming videos.